Yo, what's up? Bam, welcome. Um, I'm sorry, I, I'm not going to be able to fit uh, every little thing I'm going to be doing in this video in the title. Um, YouTube doesn't allow that. It, it only allows so long of a title. So sorry for the individuals that um, want me to, to write a book in the title. It doesn't, doesn't work that way. So, sorry about that. I um, wanted to sh show you guys... I'm upgrading my lights to LED today. Now, I'm gonna be up upgrading the lights that are on this this guy. Let's see, I think there's batteries still in here. Yeah, there's batteries still in there. You see it all lit up like that. Anyway, I bought this uh, last year for Christmas and uh, I had it in my, um, I had it in my uh, trailer, so it's got it needs to be fluffed up. <laughs> but anyway, um, I got these lights on there and I uh, put them all, strung them all in, and then I realized that they're uh, they're regular old incandescent and they run on batteries, um, and they don't last very long. They they kill the batteries pretty quick. So I found these LED lights, so I'm going to be putting those on right quick. Oh yeah, check this out, it's so much more better, I gotta do a little bit of tweaking in the lights here and there, they're a lot brighter, a lot more, be a lot more brighter, here's the old ones, batteries are getting ready to die, so, but even with a fresh pair of batteries it's still kind of dim, and another cool thing about these LEDs, is it's got a uh, twinkle or a blinking setting pretty nice huh and this guy goes on my dash there we go there's something about having a Christmas tree around this time that really uh, gets your uh, gets your spirit up I guess or um, really gets you uh your motivation up and um and everything because in winter time it's it's gray out you know it's it, you know it's depressing <laughs> so i think this might help um give me a little bit more uh joy i guess in this uh in this season so there you go it's kind of a weird thing though right um it's a weird tradition having a tree uh, for Christmas could you imagine like uh, like if we had um, a, uh, a intelligent a different intelligent ra uh, race or uh, yeah different uh, species come and visit us around this time of year and they go they go through our houses and they see uh, that we have a tree that we <laughs> you know in our living rooms and all decorated with goofy stuff um, they'd probably be thinking like what the hell what kind of weird species is this <laughs> cutting down a, a perfectly fine tree in the woods and dragging it into the house <laughs> putting it up in the living room and then like throwing a bunch of stuff on it so I bet to a different uh, species that, that would kind of be weird <laughs> but um, Got a couple more things I want to show you. All right, so I wanted to show you one more pretty cool thing that I uh, that I found uh, a couple days ago. I actually was using it um, a couple weeks after I bought the van over a year ago, and uh, this thing is it's I don't know it's been around forever. It's been around for centuries, but um, let me show you what this thing can do. It's a multi-purpose device. And uh, I actually bought two of them. Let me show you what this thing does. This thing um, gives off heat, gives off light, and they smell kind of nice depending on what you get. But check this out. What? Ah, uh, this is this is a candle. <laughs> uh, I'm just goofing off. Gives off light. Uh, gives off a tiny little bit of heat. And it smells good. <laughs> <Jeez. laughs> Alright, yeah, so 
Yeah, go pick one up. It's essential for van life. <laughs> um, I wanted to let you guys know where I'm parked at. I'm, I'm actually parked at my storage locker room. Um, didn't really need anything out of the storage room or put anything away. Uh, I, I did that a couple days ago. Uh, but while I was here last time, um, I plugged into an outlet that's right out here against the wall. Let me see if I can uh, see if I can show you this uh, this outlet here. See down there. So it's a little outlet I plug into, and uh, yeah, so I'm taking their electricity and um, I am uh, using it to uh, charge up my batteries. Now, before you say, "Oh, hey, hey man, that's not cool," you probably shouldn't do that. Uh, yes, I probably should do that um, because every every month or so, you know, they keep raising the uh, the rent on this stupid little storage locker. So. Um, my guess is that those outlets are out there for me. Probably, probably not. It's probably meant for any kind of maintenance that might need done or whatever. But no one's came out and said anything to me yet, so um, leave it at that. Now, I don't need it right now, but uh, I'll show you this this thing here I picked up too, and um, it's pretty nice. All right, so this is what I picked up. It's a electric, electrical, electric space heater. It's called Pure Heat. Bought at Lowe's. Um, this thing is uh, remarkable. It's it's kind of small. I mean, it's not too big, but it puts off quite a bit of heat. Uh, I think I have it plugged in now. Let me turn it on. Boom. Um, a couple days ago, I did I did run it off of the generator. It worked just fine. Um, yeah, it's already it's already pretty pretty hot. Um, like I said, I got it at Lowe's. It's got a, uh, uh, it's got a timer. It's got, you know, your uh, thermostat setting, and then it's got modes. I don't know what the mode is. What does the mode do? Oh, that's the fan speed. Low, high, low. Yeah. Um, but yeah, this <laughs> this little thing heats up the entire van pretty nicely. Um, and as you can see, I don't. I'm missing something, right, guys? I don't have that's the. Uh, full. Oh, okay. Thank you. Um, as you see, I don't have the uh, the propane Mr. Buddy heater in the van. Um, and actually, I had a comment and a little while ago, and he was correct. I don't remember if I mentioned it or not, but I kind of really bought that thing for the uh, for the future. I bought it for the um, the cargo trailer that I'm going to eventually buy. All right, so another upgrade I got. Uh, a while back, my aunt sent this to me from the Outer Banks, and this is a multi-purpose device as well. Right now, it's a seat cover, and sometimes it's a blanket, but most times it's a blanket. But right now, it's a seat cover. Um, <laughs> she got it from one of those uh, one of those little stores on the beach, you know, on the on the boardwalk. So she sent that to me, so um, I'm, I'm just using it, you know, for now. Um, I don't really need it. I got I got my sleeping bag back there, which keeps me plenty, plenty warm. Um, I'm I'm far behind on Q and A, guys. I got I got several good questions. I need to I need to um, get busy on that and uh, and jot everything down so I could. Um, so I can answer those questions uh, for you. Um, so, all right. Uh, I think that's it. Um, oh, anyway, guys, there you go. Just a quick, short little thing. I uh, I just wanted to pick the camera up, and um, I haven't done it in a while, and I don't want to forget how to use the thing. So, uh, anyway, um, if you got any questions, let me know. Uh, like I just mentioned, I uh, I need to get I need to get uh, on top of the uh, on top of those questions and. Uh, and just get some time and make a, uh, a nice Q&A video for you guys. And that will come up eventually. Um, give, me, give me some time. I'm, I'm still going through like a seasonal thing. Trying to get my, uh, my motivation back up and stuff. And um, uh, normally it, it takes a couple weeks for me to, you know, to kind of go with the flow with the changing of the season. You know, the, the gray skies and the sun's not coming out as, as much. So, um, yeah, it takes me some time, man. So be patient with me, 
okay <laughs> I know you guys are I mean I just I don't have to say I don't need to say it but uh, you guys know you guys are pretty cool so all right I'll leave it at that hope you guys liked it thumbs up if you did see ya